Hi, my name is Bob Grinier and I'm a volunteer with the Martin Fleischmann Memorial Project and I'm here with Bin Jun Huang in his laboratory here in New Taipei. What have you got to show me here, Bin? Yeah, this is uh, what I call the Lena water heater. Uh, this, is a proto this is a prototype uh, of the first, first, first one we made. And then uh, the water generated from this uh, boiler uses uh, to operate the reactor. The reactor is, uh, is right uh, inside the water tank. The water tank is about uh, 400 liter size. And uh, the temperature uh, we control uh, can be heated up to about 75 degrees C. And uh, the boiler uh, input power was controlled by this controller. So you got a PID control. Yeah, there's yeah? a PID controller to control the output uh, temperatures. Usually we set uh, around the uh, hundred uh, to between hundred and uh, hundred and fifty degree centigrade. Depends on uh, the operating conditions uh, to generate the nano effect. And uh, the nano reactor is very small pieces of uh, devices. Just uh, so it's, it's the, the actual, inside. you've got a, one here is the Leno reactor, yes. Yeah, here. This one here on the left. This is the Leno effect a yeah. reactor inside. And then the other pipe is just an empty tube. Right, so that is for control. We can compare the difference between yeah. the two. Yeah. So what is, what is this thing, big motor at the back here? The for? motor is uh, for mixing water to get the uniform temperature. When we measure the total heat collected. So when you say when you measure, that's only, you just stir it before you yeah, do the measure. Yeah. So about, for how long? About 20 seconds. Okay. Stir, okay. and then you measure the temperature. Because and the motor there, there is about a few hundred watts, is it? Yeah, because there's a very large temperature difference. Mm -hmm. We call it the uh, thermal stratification effect. So, we, so you've got thermoclines running through yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, we can yeah. mix up to get the accurate measurement of the heat yeah. collected. Okay, so, and what is this unit here? This is a, for, is a level, level control, level, level control device to control the low level of the boiler to mm -hmm. protect the boiler. Okay, and then round this side, what do we have? We have a couple of valves here. What, what, what's the difference between these two? The here? Valve, uh, you can control the, uh, the steam flow continuously or start up or you can run with uh, intermittent on, off, on, off operation, depends on what you need. Okay. And what do we have down here? It's a pump. And to pump the water into the boiler. Right. And that's to provide sort of pressure pulses, yeah? Yeah, yeah. The two pump together can generate about a 20 atmosphere pressure, but usually one is enough. Okay, and what's this, just a relief valve? This uh, some kind of we call is a uh, uh, I forget how to call it. It's an accumulator, something like that. Okay. Uh, to keep the pressure steady, not okay. pass. And then you've got a number of uh, pressure here? This is a, and this is a flow gauge. rate. This is a flow rate, flow meter. Yeah. Another pressure gauge here. And this is the controller, right? Yeah, this is the controller of the valve. You can adjust different uh, periods of on and off automatically. So different duty cycles, yes? Yeah, yeah. So yeah. is this the big on button? It just uh, stop. Uh, Start on and stop. On part, yeah. <laughs> okay. So that that is essentially your basic reactor, and that produces a COP of what? Mm -hmm. The co coefficients of performance. Uh, so far, it's about uh, 1.3. 1 1.3. 1 1.3. And you're going to try and put something similar to this 
into the exhibition center. Yes, yes. So, so we are still improving that. Mm -hmm. I hope we can get a point five COV. That would be wonderful, yeah. wouldn't it? And uh, the energy saving far, so far is about 23%. Fantastic. Oh. Okay, so that is the whole device. But the device is very simple. Yeah. You can make a uh, ethical rod. Well, thank you very much okay, for your you. time. Thank you. See you in the next video.